Um, I first found out about this scholarship, scholarship opportunity uh, because one of my professors put me in contact with this scholarship office with David Shug. So I went in, I met with him, heard, heard about a lot of the different opportunities, and then uh, kind of near the end of my senior year, I started to think a lot more about grad school. I heard about the Fulbright Scholarship actually by looking at laboratories for grad school, and I found a girl doing really cool research in India, and I emailed her, and she uh, told me she had done a Fulbright before going to grad school, and so I should check it out. So I looked into it, and I went on the U of I website, and I emailed Dr. Hastings, and we had uh, a small phone interview and talked about it. Um, what the next step should be. The best advice that I can give to future applicants would definitely be um, to gain confidence in yourself. I, I, I went through like a, my emotions kind of went through a roller coaster up and down where I, I kind of recognized my strengths, I, but I, I was, I honed in on my weaknesses, you know, and, and, it, and it, it just became, it was an uncomfortable process, a needed process for me as a person to grow. I, I won't take it back, but as, have confidence in yourself. I would definitely say have confidence in yourself. Pursue it. Don't do it for the award. Do it because you know that you're going to grow as a person.